Hey there everybody. Today we're going to look at what's in the box for Hazardous Movement Scenario Pack Number 2, which is called The Uncivil Wars 1936 to 1949. Now, this is the second product from Hazardous Movement from Chuck Hammond and Chad Cummins. And this one is centered all around partisans. Let's take a look what's inside. So first, um, just like the last Hazardous Movement pack, um, it comes in this heavy-duty brown folder. First thing we see is we get a little bumper sticker for our guitar case or car that says Hazardous Movement. So that's beautiful. I'm gonna put that on my guitar case. All right. Um, then we get the notes for Hasmo Pack Two: The Uncivil Wars and rules to remember and I guess there's um, some scenario descriptions and maybe some strategy and a brief uh, description of how they'll play out. Let's see, there's one, two, three, four, five. Every scenario I guess gets its own page. So there's ten, ten pages, so I expect to see ten scenarios. Let's see what we have here. First we have the beleaguered capital, and that's seven, seven turns the, um, in Spain in 1936, so it'll be the Nationalists against the Republicans. And I do believe that's a Panzer I tank that the Nationalists are using. The Russians have some Russian tanks. Alrighty. Then Another Spanish scenario, and that's um, also 1936, more Panzer 1s, all right, and Tin Men in Tianmen, which is in China, in 1945, that'll be the Communists against the Nationalists. Something interesting here is there's some Japanese soldiers that look to be fighting on the side of the Nationalists, which is odd, and it's 17th August, so right around the end of the war. World War II. Then we have uh, a Sisyphean task in uh, Calavrida, Greece, and that's in 1948. And that would be the Greek Democratic Army. And those were probably communist, I'd guess. Don't know much about that history. Against the Hellenic Army. Then we have uh, Sticks and Stones, and that's 1936 in Spain again. And or Panzer ones. All right. And then we have L'Inferno Fascista. And that's uh, Guadalajara, Spain, 1937. That is five and a half turns and about ten squads aside. And armor, too. Then we have more Spain. And that one's seven and a half turns. That's pretty big for this pack. And then we have a uh, Sophoclean tra Tragedy, Athens, Greece, in 1944. And that'll be the Elas Assault Group against the British. And then Mao's Fifth Column in 1949, Nationalists against communist again, and yellow, uh, 60 seconds of sacrifice, Yellow Cliff Mountain, Shandong Province, 1947, Chinese against nationalists, and then the credit page, and on the back, we're going to see um, that there are some special rules to do with all these scenarios and how to treat all the individual um, nationalities. So, and then a description on the back of that. So, what's different? Um, first thing I notice is the scenarios are quite a bit shorter than the last pack. The last pack, they, were, they all seem to be nine and ten turns. These are uh, six turns, five turns, six and a half turns, five and a half turns. So, they might be a little bit more playable. The uh, other differences, the um, 
there are now um, photos, pictures of the of the uh, units instead of just the um, numbers put on, and I really appreciate that. So we make sure we pull out the right stuff, and I'm a more visual guy, so I, I like that a lot too. So I'm glad they changed that. Um, what they kept the same. Oh, another thing that they changed is they put the back, the second page to a specific scenario on the back of a different scenario card, which is wonderful. So you can have both scenario cards to look at at the same time, both pages to look at at the same time without having to constantly turn it over to read the back. So I like that a lot. What they kept the same looks like the quality is impeccable. Uh, hard uh, cardstock and glossy paper. I like that a lot. Um, and the price has not gone up. For, uh, for 10 scenarios, you're paying about $3 a scenario, and that's absolutely fair for this quality of, of work. So I like that a lot. And they kept the folder the same. So, so that's, that's great. So it looks good, and can't wait to put some of these on the table and get them going. Thanks so much for watching.